what about truly i think truly's gonna be fine she'll miss everybody of course and it's gonna be hard and taking her from cody is hard it's hard don't get me wrong she's never gonna come back oh no you back. can't take her from me because we'll have to have a shared custody it'll have to be 50 50. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is having a great day. It's been a mess. It's been a lot with the sister wives drama and I've been doing my best to uncover everything I can about this family so that you guys can be in the loop of everything that's going on. But most importantly, I wanted to kind of get some things out there on the table that were misconceptions and things that were told that were absolute lies and new information from insiders like some of the children. Well, I did want to first start off with the clip that you saw ahead. Remember when earlier in the season, Cody and Christine had a, a sit down about custody as far as truly. Of course, Christine was about to move. They actually finally had a discussion, Cody and Christine, inside of the house. So it was a very interesting conversation. So of course, we know the divorce between Christine and Cody just has become really, really ugly within the past few months. And they were actually trying to work things out. So Christine, she has been more than open with viewers about how Cody has been an absent parent. He's not been coming around. However, they were faced with the prospect of truly being moved to another state. And Cody, of course, he wanted to fight dirty. So he tried to actually gaslight Christine into thinking she needed to file legal paperwork regarding Truly's custody while taking part in the sit down when they were at her house. And Cody revealed false information stating he and Christine were required to have a child custody agreement or the state of Arizona would become the owner of Truly. When I heard that, I immediately just thought, okay, now this doesn't even sound right. So I had to dig into it a little bit more. So during the sister wife's confessional, Cody revealed a dark side sharing that he got creative when it came to talking about custody agreement. Christine started to question the legal need for such an agreement and Cody, he clearly panicked claiming the rule book is what he said. However, in the state of Arizona, there is actually no legal need for the courts to take over a child custody case if both parents have agreed to a private plan. Cody even started to act like a bully as he told Christine a lawyer would take all of her money, so it would be in her best interest to get a legal 50-50 agreement. Cody seemed like he was just pretty much grasping at straws with his claims and he really upset a lot of fans and viewers. The idea that he had such audacity, I'd say, just a lie to the mother of his child and scare her because I don't know whose mom's out there, but that would scare me. Even if I haven't gotten all my facts or information together, just by the dad even coming for that saying, oh, well, the state the state is going to be in charge, and that would just freak me out. Why would he even do that? Why would he even lie? So Cody has been caught, once again, in a lie. So I would love to hear how you guys feel about that in the comments, but I also did want to discuss something else that I was digging into, and I didn't have to dig very hard because Christine's daughter, um, Gwendolyn, who... She is an adult, and I don't know if you guys remember, but she did come out. I don't think she came out on the show, but she came out as bisexual, and she's been seeing um, a young lady, and they have recently gotten engaged, but Gwendolyn does have a Patreon. If you guys don't know what that is, it's just basically another social media platform where I guess you could say semi-celebrities, A-list celebrities can get on there. They can answer questions from fans, but of course, you know, the fans got to pay to get a little bit of information. But Gwendolyn and Robin has not always been on the best terms, or recently Gwendolyn has expressed her dislike for Robin. However, one of the fans did ask some questions about their relationship, and Gwendolyn said something that bothered her. She said that, Robin told Gwen that she should have waited to come out 
while the cameras were rolling on air. So what do you guys think about that? Is it almost makes me feel like what is real, what is fake? Like what is Cody and Robin actually trying to do? Um, it makes you question their authenticity. Like why are they trying to make her wait to expose such a intimate moment on air? I don't know, but you guys let me know how you feel in the comments below. I certainly do appreciate you listening and watching and trust me, please like and subscribe to my channel because I will be back with more juicy details. Bye for now.